If you like this video, please press like and consider subscribing. Thank you. Recently discovered exoplanet around faint red dwarf star, the Banard star, is very likely habitable or conducive to development of life on the surface or subsurface of the planet. One of the nearest exoplanets near our own solar system could support primitive life. Scientists have announced the nearby world orbiting around Barnard star, the second closest star system to our own, is known as Super Earth and has potential to serve as home for simple alien life. Barnard star is a low-mass red dwarf star, about 14.5% of solar mass and about 20% of our own sun diameter or some 280,000 kilometers across. The star is around 9 billion years old, could be less, or twice as old as our own sun, but surface temperature is barely 3,140 Kelvin, about as half as hot as our own sun. Due to the orbit of the planet, which orbits its host star around 60 million kilometers, the planet is probably very cold at minus 170 degrees centigrade. But if Bernard's star has similar makeup to our own Earth, with large iron nickel core, with strong magnetic field, and strong geothermal activity, as scientists predict, it might be able to harbor primitive life. That is, according to Villanova University astrophysicist Edward Guinan and Scott Engel, who announced their findings at major meeting of astronomers. The researchers suggest that a planet known as Barnard B might be surprisingly habitable as a result of processes that are happening underneath its surface. Geothermal heating could support life zones under its surface, akin to subsurface lakes found in Antarctica. We know that surface temperatures on Jupiter's icy moon Europa is similar to Barnard's B, but because of tidal heating, Europa probably has liquid oceans under its icy surface. Scientists announced the discovery of Barnard's B in November, but it was described as being very hostile to any possible life. It is an icy desert without liquid water, where the sun shines only dimly, and the temperature is cold enough to kill any life that might flourish. But a suggestion of heat flowing from underneath its surface could make it better home than they thought. The planet has a mass just over three times that of the Earth, and goes around the star every 233 days roughly the same distance that Mercury orbits our Sun. Researchers now hope they can look more at the planet in attempt to understand its atmosphere, surface and potential habitability. Whatever they find in the future, the planet has already shown us that such planets might be more common than we realized, suggesting that yet more of them are waiting to be found. The most significant aspect of discovery of Barnard B is that the two nearest star systems to the Sun are known to host planets. To support previous studies based by Kepler mission data, inferring that planets can be very common throughout the galaxy. There is a question of potential human colonization of the planet Barnard B one day in distant future, as more data on the newly discovered planet becomes available, and hopefully, with the launch of new powerful telescopes that are coming online in the near future, we might pick into the planet's atmosphere, as well as study the planet in greater detail, revealing more information about the planet. Again, further research is needed, but planets with such mass will still produce relatively small increase in surface gravity and escape velocity, opening the doors for future human colonization. However, there still might be Earth-sized planets in the system with even better prospects for future human colonization.